Hello! In this video of our multi-part series, I'll walk you through a simple example of how to best utilize the entire Talent Cloud platform, ultimately to achieve your cloud analytics. Today, I want to create a Tableau report containing clean and easy to read data displaying which of our customers purchased high-risk chemicals versus how many purchased medium or low-risk chemicals. I also want to be able to provide sales information to my sales team regarding which accounts purchased the high-risk chemicals since we're about to roll out a new product line that is all organic and not as risky. To create this report, I can take advantage of data preparation to cleanse and enhance my customer data from Salesforce with external data containing chemical information. Once that preparation is completed, I'll use Talent Integration Cloud to load the data into my analytical data warehouse within Snowflake. I've already gone into the studio and developed a simple job designed to take multiple tables from Salesforce, join and enhance them within a team app, and then push the output data into a preparation within data preparation. I'm using what's called a live dataset, meaning that this job will run each time a business user clicks on this data set or preparation within data preparation, guaranteeing that he will be working with the most current data available from Salesforce. Now that this job is set up, I'll publish it to the appropriate cloud account. Once publishing is complete, I can head to that Talent Integration Cloud account and see my new process available within my list of flows. In order to set this process in motion, I need to identify what my Salesforce connection is for this preparation. I've already created a new connection called worldbeauty underscore SFDC, so I'll select that one and click Save. Now I can head to my data preparation tool. I can create a new dataset by selecting the Add Dataset Swivel Arrow and then From Talent Job. I'll provide an appropriate name and then enter the same cloud credentials where my job was published. I'll test the connection. Great! Now I can choose from my list of available environments where live data jobs have been established. And I'll also select my flow from my data preparation processes. Finally, I can load the dataset. Within the Talent Cloud, I can view the updated run history and see that indeed my job ran successfully. Now I can enter my dataset and begin cleansing and enhancing my data to meet the needs of my business. I'll add a filter to the last name column to ensure all names are uppercase. Once I apply my filter action, it's listed within my recipe to the left of my data. I see my order dates listed in various formats, so I'll choose to reformat my dates to the default so that they are consistent. I also have a column containing each record's product external number. I want to join this data with another dataset to retrieve more information in order to provide additional depth to this column's contents. Here's a source file from S3 containing chemical product information. From this source file, I'll choose to include activity and chemical name data and click Confirm. In order to make my data a bit more user-friendly and easier to read in our analytic reports, I'll adjust some of these codes indicating risk levels in our chemicals. I'll change CBI to low, I to high, and M to medium. I'll rename the column, too, to better reflect its contents. The second lookup column containing the chemical names looks pretty muddled, listing various types of information without distinct separators. I'll choose to split text into parts and separate the data using commas. And finally, I'll remove trailing and leading characters within the last column to get rid of those pesky white spaces. Now that I've completed some basic preparation steps, I want to automate the process. Back in Studio, I have another job that starts out much like our live dataset, feeding data from Salesforce to data preparation. But now I'll take advantage of the new preparation to write out my data to Snowflake. I'll publish this job. I'm then able to head to the Talent Integration Cloud to run the process.
I'll make sure to have my Salesforce and Snowflake connection selected before clicking Go. And finally, within Snowflake, I can view clean data in my new reporting tables. And now I can head over to Tableau and view my easy-to-read Tableau report showing me how many customers purchased high-risk chemicals, as well as additional sales information listing top accounts my sales team can target when promoting our new low-risk organic chemical product line. And that's how to utilize the entire Talent Cloud platform ultimately to achieve your cloud analytics. Thank you for watching. Please continue watching this series for more demonstrations of Talent software.